When the mRNA COVID-19 vaccines were first authorized in the United States in late 2020, healthcare personnel were among those prioritized for vaccination. Interim real-world data on the vaccine's effectiveness in this group have been published, but longer-term data are needed, particularly among subgroups disproportionately affected by COVID-19 or at high risk for severe disease. A new study offers updated estimates on mRNA vaccine effectiveness against symptomatic COVID-19 in healthcare personnel. In this test-negative case control study, 1,482 U.S. healthcare personnel in 25 states who had at least one COVID-19-like symptom and tested positive for SARS-CoV-2 between late December 2020 and mid-May 2021 were matched to 3,449 personnel who tested negative. Participants' vaccination status was determined, and vaccine effectiveness against symptomatic COVID-19 was estimated. Overall, 11% of the COVID-19 cases and 31% of the controls had been completely vaccinated with one of the two mRNA vaccines. That is, at the time of SARS-CoV-2 testing, they had received two doses, and it had been at least seven days since the second dose. The estimated effectiveness of complete vaccination was high, and was similar with the two vaccines. High effectiveness was also seen in subgroups according to age, race or ethnicity, underlying conditions such as obesity, asthma, and diabetes, and level of patient contact. For pregnant women, the effectiveness of partial and complete vaccination was estimated, and again was found to be high. The authors conclude that both mRNA vaccines were highly effective against symptomatic COVID-19 among U.S. healthcare personnel in a real-world setting, with a high level of protection observed among those at risk for severe COVID-19. Full study results are available at NEJM.org.